Oh, this is gonna be annoying. There's about 500 amounts of invisible everything preventing me from moving. Look, look at this. I can't even move any further. I can't even jump on this. There we go, finally. Well, that's not good. Now I have to rush really fucking fast. Jump! Fly! Fly faster! Is that it? Okay. I'm lost now. Thanks, game. That cutscene really helped me. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, this, this, this is just horrible. I can't even do anything here. This entire section is not even... Oh. I can't. I can't even. It won't let me out. It, it just won't let me. There's an invisible ledge here. Yeah. Oh boy, this is going to be horrid. There's pretty much every invisible wall and obstacle blocking you from even being able to jump. I can see this as being absolutely fucking trash. This is one of those you don't want to play the mod anymore past this point. I mean, there's nothing redeeming anymore about this mod. Like, look at this. I can't even get up here because it's fucking blocking me. Please, cutscene. Go away. Not to mention you have the horrid-ass stamina bar, which basically stunts your jumping abilities like tenfold. Oh, for the love of fuck. And I'm stuck. Oh, for the love of... These controls are fucking awful. Why am I stuck? What am I stuck on? Oh, this game. Can I get out, please? There we go. I think I made it. Hopefully. Oof. Oh, and now I'm stuck on invisible walls. There we go. Oh. Wow, this is so clunky. Find your way out of the forest. That train part is horrible because you're like... It's like invisible hitboxes everywhere. Every object is pretty much bigger hitbox than its actual object itself. So you end up, like, bumping into every single thing, trying to squish your way through the tiniest little crevices in order to escape. It just becomes pure frustration. I should probably grab one of those lanterns. Yes, probably. Better than nothing, I guess. Let's set that in slot number three. That in slot number two. 
There we go. Now I can whack. Let's see where the hell we're going. Looks like this way. I don't know why you can actually have more than one lantern, especially considering, you know, you're carrying one. I guess those are just for show. Those just lead you to where you're supposed to go. It's interesting how you can pick them up, though. Or you probably could if you drop this one. Let's see. There's water everywhere. Might have to climb up there. Jump. Yep. Climb over this creepy wall. Somebody conveniently just plays these lanterns around so that I could find my way. I don't think there's anything around them. At least I hope not. That would suck. If I'm missing items. So apparently you're in some kind of forest. After the train wrecked. Hmm. I don't see another lantern nearby. Guess I'll just keep following this path. There it is. Always keep an eye on the ground. This wall's completely broken. Over here? Nope. Nothing. Ah, good. Save point. So you don't have to do that horrid train again. Let's proceed further along this path. Fuck. It's another chainsaw guy. That's not good. There's another lantern. What is that? What is that? What? The fuck? Uh oh. Do! Hi! Um, this isn't good. I don't know where I'm supposed to go. I need a doorknob. Oh god. I think I'm dead because I can't drop this. There's no quick key for dropping this. Wow. He just stood there for some unknown reason. Oh, this game. This game. 
I mean, what's the point? At least it saved me here. It's so frustrating that these items take the inventory. And now I'm stuck on an invisible wall again. I think... Oh, for fuck's sake. My biggest gripe with this game... Oh, look at that. You can't even fucking make it to the door. How stupid is that? This game is full of so many bad mechanics. Like, I mean, holy crap. Did they really fuck up with this game? And now I'm stuck on an invisible wall again. Of course. Uh, this is a bad game, don't play it. <laughs> it's really quite terrible. I mean, they have such stupid design decisions for some of the shit. Oh. I love how I can just perfectly home in on it. Oh, I don't know where the fuck I'm going. somehow make it all the way through with this guy who can just fucking supersonic his way straight towards me. <laughs> Woo! Did it. Oh, so frustrating. So many really terrible design decisions in this game, like really bad. <laughs> Those chainsaw guys are immune to being killed. They literally cannot be killed. Somebody's having a temper tantrum. Also, those chainsaw guys are cheap one-hit kills as well. So that also doesn't help. No oh, good. Wow, they can hit you ten times faster than you can ever hit them. <laughs> shame that this game has to go so downhill. At least I have some syringes. So it's not a big, big deal. Can I push this? There's a big box blocking the door and it's too heavy to move. Of course. Too heavy to move. So I gotta find a new place to get to it.
Oh. I love how they take like five billion shots to kill. Where is this? Is it still inside that building? question is what do you give up you either give up your health you give up your means of fighting or you give up your only light yep exactly oh this game There's no, there's no end to this game's horrible, horrible mechanics. I don't know what this is. Drop me. Ah, I see. So apparently there's a, um, another blade somewhere. Of course, you can't do it with one part of the scissors, you need both. Let's drop this down here. Kind of tempted to go back in there and beat the crap out of that thing. I'm not sure if I should. This looks like another area the door I came out. Possibly. I have to find the left half of the scissors. Maybe it's in here. No, this is that way. No, this is a different area because I don't remember that syringe being there. Oh, hi. And I'm stuck in the tree. Fuck's sake, game. Fuck's sake. Oh, of course. Now I can't see anything. I cannot see fucking anything. Game! Oh, this game! Fuck this game! Oh, fuck this game. Seriously, fuck this fucking game. Oh, my God. Fuck this fucking game so much. It is so terrible. Words cannot even define how bad this mod is. Oh, this mod is so bad. This mod is so bad. I wish it was over. I really wish it was over. It just gets worse and worse. Oh. Invisible walls don't even bother dodging these fucking things because they can hit scan you like crazy. Oh. Terrible mod. This is the last time I ever play this game ever again. See ya, Pumpkin Zero. Have a good one. I'm never playing this ever again. Ever, ever again. Don't ever ask me to play Afraid of Monsters, because that is a pile of horse shit. Afraid of Monsters is probably one of my most hated mods of all time. Absolutely god-awful. This one's about a million times better than that.
I don't know how I missed that syringe on the floor last time. The sad thing about this mod is it's good until halfway and then it just goes downhill. So up to the halfway point it just goes straight down the toilet. Clunky combat, clunky level design, horrible fucking inventory. It's not even, it's not even, you know, say any more about how awful the inventory is. Then it becomes that fetch quest with the uh, fuse boxes. Which is... Oh. Fucking game, seriously. Don't you just love how you're fucking trying to, you know, drop an item? But no, an enemy's trying to fucking slice and dice you while you're trying to drop an item? Then you have to fucking... Now nah, I can't see shit, look at this. Look at this. This is exactly what I'm talking about. Oh, this game is... Oh, this mod. This fucking mod, like seriously. What were they fucking thinking with this horrible pile of crap? I don't know what I actually- I think I dropped a syringe, but now I'll never find it because I dropped it in haste. I drop it here somewhere? No, this is this fucking area again. Let's see if I can find the other place. Was it here? I know I dropped something here. And now I can't find it. There it is. We'll use this. Use the scissors and cut this off. Ha! Huh. Who would have thought a TV was strong enough to break a box?
Now let's go through these tunnels again. Because it was fun going through them the first time. careful because of these stupid doors. Everything in this is insta-death. <coughs> Creepy ass fucking monster. I hope we're done with the insta-death area now. Probably not. Let's see where we are now. Creepy ass doctor guy again. Before we go follow him. Let's see what's over here. Anything? No. Nope. Time to follow creepy doctor guy. Oh shit. Inside of some kind of insane asylum. Block from the other side. Never a good sign. Ah, fuck. 